Hold on, hold on. Let me, hold on. Let me get Mr. Holtz in on there. Uh, Mr. Holtz, you want, you want to comment on this, brother? Go ahead. Hey, can you all hear me? Yeah, what's yeah. going on, brother? Mm-hmm. How you doing? What's up, Tommy? What's up, brother? What's going on, brother? Uh, I was just trying to get uh, I wanted Black Achievement to finish talking So I can get I'm trying to get the point that he's trying to make And I'm not quite getting it uh, Can you help me out Which, what, what what was I saying uh, No just point whole, about, I, listen, I've been listening for a little bit And I'm just trying to get Okay okay, okay here's, let, let me see if I can bring it home a little bit here Here's what I noticed Mr. Holtzism Is when other people outside of our community who come from humble beginnings, like the immigrants who come here crossing the line illegal, without jobs, without uh, monies and whatnot, and they do well, we hold them up as being model citizens, Say, hey, so-and-so didn't have this, didn't have that, but look, they're getting all A's or they're going to college or they're trying to get the dream out. Are, are, you know, they, really do, hold on, are they really doing well? Because I think a lot of that is fabricated. Yeah. Would, it be, would, it be safe, would it be safe to say that the reason why this is going on is because black people in this country have a dysfunctional culture? Mm-hmm. Would that be safe to say? Like their values? Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. I, 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 will, I will agree with that. Yes. I mean, okay. Yeah, yeah I, I, I'm no, fine with that. Yep. But my question to you is, how did that happen, and how do you fix it? Ooh, oh, man, <laughs> that's a good question. Um, I, I, let, let me just go back and just respond a little bit to um, what Taylor and, 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 and uh, Thomas said very quickly. Well, 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 the reason well, well, why we're well, 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 I don't, 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 I'm going to answer, I'm, I'm I'm gonna answer don't, your question. Don't, 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 don't answer, the man, answer the man's question. He asked you a direct question. Answer the question. You, I, Thomas, you asked me a question as well. So did Caleb. Okay. No, 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 no. And answer why, his question. We leave, we, I yield my time to his question. I, no, you, <laughs> let, me, let me say this uh, very quick. Uh, the reason why there is such an unemployment crisis among our young people is simply this. We don't hire. When we feel like we're ready to hire, then the unemployment uh, We don't got no jobs to get over. We don't have so, no jobs to hire. I, I just said you, you asked me about unemployment, and the reason why we have an unemployment crisis is that we don't hire. There's no unemployment you crisis. Have, you got to have business to hire I people at Black Achievement. Well, what, 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 what are you living on? Wait, 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 go get the businesses. Why can't I finish my point you here? You don't look I like just a wanna... there's a, hold on, there's, a, there's a one small problem that you just don't seem to get. You know, the white man has the business. It's his land. We can't just take the business. Now, if we were basically, like you said, we're, the reason why we're nationalists because we understand that we need a land of all You're not a nationalist. You're not a nationalist. Yeah. You're not yes, a nationalist. I am a nationalist. Yes, I am a nationalist. You, you know, you, no, you know? no, no, no. You, 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 you're, you're a nationalist in speech, in rhetoric. No, you I am a national. I am a national. I am black, black achievement. I believe ultimately African Americans have to have their own independent government. That, that's the only okay. way to solve our problems. Uh, that's okay. I, I, right, right. I, I have no problem with that. But, but what I'm saying to you is, every time I say something, the default is. Oh, the white man won't let us. The white man has this. The white man has that. No, we're, we're saying black That's achievement. That's what I just said. said. You no, said the white man all the Have you hold on, hold on, black achievement? Have you ever seen any Japanese company that's prosperous in the United that formed in the United States? No. Toyota, Sumitomo, Sony, all these people. Where they come? You study. I studied Japan's economic system through and through. It started by humble beginnings in the little islands of Deshima, Edo Bay. Uh, Yokohama, all these places were little tiny trading companies that grew up the big giant firms helped by a what? A Japanese government. You know, they're called the Zaibatsus. Now it's called the Keretsus. These are Japanese trading firms that, uh, that morphed into industrial firms and international trading firms that grew into giant companies. The assets, they were able to rate their own assets by, uh, by their own value system. They were the first uh, country to pull themselves up to Western standards on their own. You know, the same thing could happen with African Americans. If we had our own land, we could basically put our asset pool up for ourselves. You know, we wouldn't even need any help, any investment but, for anybody. Well, We're the only people well, that well, do well, that. Well, you know, well, 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 we have our industries. 
Well, one thing is, this, I want to shed a little insight because this, this is the thing that's just absolutely maddening to me is that, one, we try to act like things like, you know, the fact that, one, the banks don't, they simply just aren't willing to lend. Even if you go in there with a solid business plan with 10-year projections, the likelihood of you getting a small business loan from a bank that has authority to lend um, through SBA in a lot of cases, if you're a black person going to these banks, I mean, black team, I work in the bank industry. I've seen, you know, we actually had training on this, the fact that there was still, like, a myriad of banks that are still discriminating against people yeah. just, based, just, on, just based on race alone. They're, mm-hmm. they're redlining. We, I'm talking about we actually have, Rich. like, I have, like I, have, I, have, I have data. I have actual data that shows the discrimination that is happening right now. I'm talking about there are at least 50 different cases where they have to pay punitive damages because of redlining, because of discrimination. 50. I'm talking about in the past two and a half years alone. So the fact that we say... Thomas, that, that's not our fight, Thomas. I'm sorry, that's not well, our fight. Wait, hold on, what do you mean? Well, well, that's that's right, right, that's 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 right, we don't hire. Well, how do you get the capital if the capital is being held from you? Okay, I, I'll we answer that very quickly. Let me answer the question, brother. Let me give me thirty seconds and I'll answer that. Here's how you get capital. Every dollar that you have in your pocket has to remain within your community. That's how capital is developed and grown. You cannot allow your dollars to go outside of your community. Your network. Hey, that's, that's how we build. That's obvious that's, there, you that's know. That's how, yeah, man, we've had that conversation before. That's just so good. That's, that's not. That's not going. That we've said that's black that nationalism one on one. Yeah, oh, yeah, I know, but that that was the black uneducated nationalist. You know, we're on a different level right now. You think the white man? That's, that's uh, not even uh, realistic. I, I figured that out. I figured that out. That's not you know, that was what we talked about hundred years when we all you, you black star. Your, your business would start. You show me. Show me a, a, a successful. A successful quote unquote business, right? That's run by a black person, other than a soul food restaurant, yeah. other than somebody, other than somebody who sells oils, incense, and car sales and bootleg videos, <laughs> and, and that to rely strictly on a black dollar. Can I get my question answered? Oh yeah, Kayla. Thank, thank you, thank you, Mr. Howell. Let me ask you a question very, very quickly, Mr. Hobson. Thank you. That's a good question, brother. Very excellent question. Let me say this. What has happened in the black community uh, is this. Economically, we got to make a living. You've got to find a way to put money in your pocket. So if the legitimate economy, as uh, Brother Thomas so uh, uh, adequately described it, if the unemployment rate among young black men is 40%, 50%, in some cities it's more than 50%, you've got to go out in the underground economy and try to make your way, be it, Running numbers, selling crack, selling marijuana, uh, uh, boosting, whatever it may be, you got to do something to uh, feed yourself and your family, or do whatever it is you have to do. What this has done is that this has uh, perpetuated a, a, a false um, a moral and value system in our community, where okay. those things that are so egregious, so wrong somehow it's not looked at as being so wrong because we believe that the brother and sister got to do what they got to do to feed their family. This creates a warped sense of morals, a warped sense of values, a, 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 a warped sense of community. This is I why agree. it's very difficult for me no, to I, talk I, I, to our I people. I agree with you. I agree. You know, yeah. yeah, yeah, so, so I, I, agree, I agree with that you. Really that. Sums, but here's the thing I say, as a, as, a, as, a, as a black nationalist show enough, I got to take you out. I can't have you selling crack in my community where my kids got to okay. go to school. I can't have you robbing my grandmama for a Social Security check. I no, can't we have all, you robbing okay. We well, all know that. Can I, can I focus on that right there? Yeah, please. If I, if I can just get a chance to get this in. Now, you're saying you just explained to me 
A socioeconomic and political situation is causing these brothers to do what they do. But then I'm hearing you say you want to go to these brothers and stop them from doing what they do without addressing the social, economic, and political system. So it's just going to stay the way. You don't want to say that. Say that. You don't want to challenge the front of the system. That's what I'm saying. I didn't say that. No, but that's, that's, that's what you're just saying. But no, no, no. You, no, 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 it's, it's what you're not hold saying, Black. No, 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 I don't want to misquote you, so if, I, if, I, if I'm misrepresenting what you're saying, please correct me. Because I heard you say, we got to go to these brothers and tell them, we don't want you doing this in our community. We don't want you doing that in our community. That's what yes, I heard that's you correct. say. Okay, yes. so what about the socioeconomic and political system that's putting them in, in a position to do that in the first place? How are we going to address that? I, I, I just told you is this. We have to develop a model of pure black economics. Where every dollar you have, you got, I don't care if the damn grocery store is a hut, is an outdoor market. Your money, your dollars have to stay within your community, have to go to people Thank that you. are hiring Thank your people. Okay, Thank you. you. I cannot. agree with you 100%. Wait, 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 we all agree with that. We all agree with that, but that's the most. Wait, 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 I'm not finished. I'm not okay, finished. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. So there's, there's other, there's, it's, it's a multi pronged approach. Then you also have the education. We have to have a com- competitive educational experience. We cannot have a, a situation where our schools are holding pins for thugs. Well, what's the glue for? What is the glue for all this? What is the glue? God damn it, the glue to hold all that together, Kayla. No, uh, the what's the glue? The glue? The glue is culture, and culture is long-term culture is a ability to be a nation. Without that, you have no reason to be together. That's what you have right now. Yeah, I just wanted to make a statement based on on just everything that was said. And Carl is right, one hundred percent. That um, I, I I feel for Black Achievement because I think he's a good brother. I mean, I really he is, he is, man, but, he's a good brother. But what I'm really concerned about, what I'm really concerned about, is his health because you are going to get a heart attack or get high blood pressure dealing with these Negroes thinking that they're going to change their behavior without culture. You're going to drive yourself yeah. to an early grade if you keep thinking. You will, you will go crazy. You will end up hating black people. That's what's going to happen. Really. You're black as you're going to end up hating your own race. And my thing is, and I just want to say this, because there seems to be a lot of misinterpretation about what cultural, culture is and nationalism is. I'm going to give you my perspective. I don't disregard any of our history. I don't disregard our history on the continent, and I don't disregard our history in this country. I include all of that in the equation. So I'm not trying to say we go into Africa and we're just going to forget about all of our history and all this. No, we're we're part of who we are is our experience in America. We're different from Nigeria. Everything in totality. So I don't see how anybody can really argue with me on this point. We have to reconnect with our history and our culture so that we can have cultural cohesion. If we do not have that, nothing, nothing is going to work. And I don't see how that's even an argument. How is that even an argument? We're looking at the, 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 the example of it right now. Everything's in place. All of these, it's like when you have a... a a lion or a, no, a, a, a gorilla, and you have him in a cage all of his life. If you open up the cage, the logical thing is for him to just go, leave, leave the cage and go and be free. But don't you know he won't do that? He'll go right back in the cage and lock He'll stay right in that cage because that's what he's used to and that's what he's comfortable with. 